Howdy, howdy everyone. Today in this video, I will walk you through a step by step method how you can prevent yourself from adding a new contact which is already in your Outlook contact list. That means you want to merge two different duplicate contacts in Outlook. There are two scenarios. First, when you want to add a new contact and which is already in your contact list, Outlook automatically merge your new contact with the existing contact. And second is if your address book consists of multiple contacts and some of them are duplicates, how you can remove or merge or delete those duplicate contacts from your address book. So let's get started. First of all, click on the people from the left navigation section or you can also use control three keyboard shortcut to get there. Now here I have a new contact list which is currently empty. I want to add two duplicate contacts here. So for that I have to click on the new contact. Now this new contact form appears. I want to add my name, my email address, click save. So this is my first contact and I want to add another one with the same name and same email address. So you will see what happens. See, both the contacts with the same name and same email addresses are added in my address book, which I don't want. I want if I accidentally enter a new contact in my address book that will automatically merge or prevent me from adding a new contact. So first option is click on the file tab from the left navigation section, click on options and here outlook options dialog box appears. There are a few segments from the left section and the right section. Click on people and here there are a few options here. So you have to see name and filling. Check for duplicates when saving new contacts. This checkbox is unchecked. You have to check it, click on it, simply hit OK. Now you have activated a feature when you accidentally add a new contact that will automatically show you a notification. So you can very easily manage your contact according to your requirement. Again, I click on the new contact, enter the name, Again, enter the same email address. Now I simply hit save and close. Now you will see a duplicate contact detected. I have already created a detailed video on it. You will get the link on the description section and you can also check out the card on your right corner of your screen. So you will see duplicate contact detected. The name or email address of the contact already exists in the contact folder. Would you like to? So you have two options here, add a new contact or update information or selected contact. A backup copy will be saved in a deleted item folder. So you will see the input you have given here is already matches with the existing contact available in the address book. So what you have to do currently, you don't have to click on any other option here because by default Outlook already selected this option, update information of selected contact. You don't have to do anything else. You have to simply hit on update this contact. Now you will see your new contact. What you have created is merged in any of this contact. But the problem is this feature only works for the future inputs. But if you have already an existing contact, which is duplicate, what you will do? There are a couple of methods which I'm going to discuss in detail in this video. First method is import and export feature and second method is you can use your Gmail account to make this happen very easily. So let's get started. First of all, you have to create a duplicate contact folder here and move all your contact from your existing contact to the duplicate contact because when you merge the contacts in your backend, you can again import those contact back to this folder. So first select your folder, click right mouse button, click new folder and you will see create new folder dialog box appears. Here you have to name it. So I name it merge contact. 
now simply hit ok now on the bottom you will see a new folder with merge contact appears now you have to do is to select the existing contact here select any contact of your simply hit ctrl a now simply hit ctrl shift v that will open a move item dialog box here you want to move your existing contact address book to the merge contact so the merge contact is already selected here all you have to do is to simply hit ok now you will see your existing contact is empty and both the contacts are moved to the merge contact that is the end of first stage now the second stage is you have to export this folder to your desktop system which is exported in a form of .csv file so click on the file tab you will see an option open and export click here there are few options here and there is an option import and export click on it now import and export wizard dialog box appears you have to simply hit export to a file click next create a file of type there are two segments comma separated values and outlook data file here you have to use comma separated values select it hit next you have to select folder to export from so this merge contact is already selected you don't have to do anything else here clicking on the file tab it is better to select the merge contact here so when you open it and uh, reach to this op stage export to a file that will automatically selected here now simply hit next now save export file as you have to select or browse a location so i usually use desktop and i have to name it so i name merge contact and i used to enter the date simply hit ok now again hit next simply hit finish now it will take a second and your file will be saved in your computer so this is the end of second stage now the third stage you have to import your saved file back to the outlook but this time that option that feature will help you out and remove all your duplicate contact from the list so again click on the file tab click on open and export again click on import and export but now you have to import from another program or file previously you have exported the file but now you have to import from another program or file click next your file is comma separated values click next now you have to browse your you have to select your file so again click on browse i have saved my file in the on the desktop and here is my file select it click okay now the tricky part is here options replace duplicate with items imported allow duplicate to be created and the third and very important which is do not import duplicate items so i simply select this and hit next now i have to select the folder so my original folder is this contacts and i want to import my contact back to this folder now import a file dialog box click next and there is an option map custom field so i simply hit on it now here i have to map the contact details which is here i have first name middle name last name email address phone number with the by default all the fields here in outlook so i simply click on this plus my first name i want to simply drag here first name middle name and last name are already there and second in the another thing is email address so i simply click here select the email drag it here and simply hit okay all set hit finish it will take a second now you will see your original contact folder open it and i have and i have two contacts in the merge contact with the same details and after importing my original contact only have one contact this is the example i have taken considering only two contact but if you have numerous contact list in your folder that will also work just like that 
So this is the import and export method. I will show you the third method which is using your Gmail account. So let's get started. So I have opened my Google and from the previous stage I have already saved or exported my .csv file. So here I don't have to do anything else here. I simply have to import the file in Gmail. So simply click on the this is pair of ellipses and you will see an option contacts click on it and you are redirected to your to the contact form now here you have to click on new contact create multiple contacts create multiple contact dialog box appears there is an uh, option have a csv or v cards file import contact instead so i simply hit import contact now i have to select the file so again click on the file select file go to your location so here is my file click open simply hit import it will take few seconds and see my both email addresses with same name and same email address are added here now what you have to do is to simply select any email address here that will enable the selection section here you will click on this drop down select all now my both email addresses are selected now you will see a small option which is merge here it will only appears when you select all the contacts if there is a duplicacy it will automatically appears so simply hit merge and in few seconds both the email addresses are merged with with each other and you will get only a single email address here now that way you can use gmail account feature to merge your multiple email or duplicate contacts with each other now you have only one email address that means your all the contacts are merged now you simply have to click on this export button now the export contact dialog box appears here you have to select few options when you click on this drop down it will ask you which contact folder you want to export so my folder is already selected here i don't want to do anything else here now export as there are three options google csv file outlook csv file and v cards for ios contacts so i simply select outlook vsv file hit export now your contact is exported in this file now the next step is you have to import this file to your outlook folder so again i will open my outlook my original contact folder is empty currently so to import that file i have to again click on the file tab click on open and export click import and export from here now import from another program or file which is already selected click next comma separated values i don't want to change it click next now the three options although my contact is already merged so there is no relevance of this options here but still select this do not import duplicate items for your safety click browse select your file where it was saved so i will check my downloads here is my file click on it click okay click next now again you have to select the folder which is already by default selected because earlier i have already selected this folder from here then i start the process so this folder is automatically selected here click next now the import a file you again have to map custom field although you can drag and drop the options but i will set it to default map click okay click finish in few seconds your single merged contact will be back to your folder that way you have used your gmail account also to remove all your duplicate contacts from your outlook that's a very lengthy process but it works there is another and very time taken process which is manually you will select one by one your email your contact and remove it so we have learned couple of things in this video first always enable the feature that will protect you to add a new contact which is accidentally a duplicate contact or if you have existing duplicate contacts in your address book you can use import and export feature or your gmail account 
to merge your duplicate contacts. I hope you have learned something new from this video. If you really enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe my YouTube channel and don't forget to click on the bell icon so you will never miss out any outlook tips and problem solver videos I come up with. Thank you and have a nice day.